Welcome to WXTV, your online source for weatherization training. In continuing on with our mobile home series, we'll head back to North Dakota for some more techniques on insulating the attic spaces. We'll catch up with Brian of Devil's Lake who will guide us through blowing attic insulation from the interior. Hello, Brian with Devil's Lake Estimating. Today we'll be doing an attic, a method that we use inside, drilling a two and a half inch hole, covered up with a two and a half inch plastic plug. Okay, here we've already got the center holes marked out they're drilling the hole for blowing the insulation in marking the center holes as we're drilling the holes we use a vacuum to suck up most of the dust and on the floor we lay down plastic just to help contain the dust and the mess. two and a half inch plastic plug, put a bead of caulking around, and then that will get shoved up in the hole. The caulkings prevent any moisture or anything getting up inside the hole to seal it off. And just take a finger and go around it and make a nice bead. Sealed off. Now we've completed one whole room what we're going to do, uh, like we did in the other trailers, we're going to make sure we're getting the right density. So what what we do is we've got a TI-86 calculator we have software written for. And we take the dimensions of the room, put plug in how many pounds of insulation we've blown, and it'll give us the answer to, to make sure that we're getting that, that pound and a half per cubic foot that we should be getting. Well, that's it for another episode of WXTV. If you're curious about additional methods for insulating the attic spaces in these mobile homes, be sure to check out the other episodes in this series. And thanks for watching. WXTV, your online source for weatherization information, techniques, and expert advice.